Roman Egypt 50 AD. This is Hero. He is reading Vitruvius's De Racha Tectura. Hero has a brain wave. He decided to make this spinning machine. It was called E.E. E. Olipile. It was the world's first steam engine. So what does this look like in practice? Two holes tangents to the center are pierced in the can, and it is then suspended by a thin thread and heated by a Bunsen burner to boiling point. But how does this work? Every action has an equal and opposite reaction. Steam engines were one of the most significant developments in human history. Everything from transportation on boats and trains, to powering the Industrial Revolution's factories, steam engines pushed humanity to greater heights. However, the Industrial Revolution wasn't the first time that a steam engine prototype was developed. In fact, the earliest known instance of a steam engine is believed to have come from around the 1st century AD in Roman Egypt. The Yolopile, as it was called, was an invention credited to Heron of Alexandria. It was very simple, basically just a metal ball filled with water placed on an axle. The water was heated, and the steam would escape from two individual points that would cause the ball to spin rapidly. It's not known what it was used for, but obviously it did not catch on in the same way that steam engines did during the Industrial Revolution. 